There is a YouTuber named Ya Nike, or it's maybe Ya Nike, who is Belgian and was arrested for throwing a concoction of weird substances on people as a prank. And when I say this straight up, just doesn't make any sense. It's like this Mr. Beastification weird thing of YouTube where like people will literally do anything nowadays for clout. But I think this is just a little bit different as why would your brain even think to do something like this? Very similar to America, it's literally just an assault charge, so good job, I guess. I'm just gonna go through and read the translation that I did from French, and obviously keep in mind that this is a little loose and could be slightly wrong, but I think for the most part, it, it it's understood what he put in this. Penultimate surprise from the chef before 2024. He then goes on here to say, this series will resume after winter and spring of next year if everything goes as I imagine. I don't know if that's him saying that everything will continue if he's getting views and stuff. I would imagine that's kind of the objective of a YouTube channel, or maybe he's saying, if I imagine Imagine not being arrested <laughs> on an assault charge. So now we're gonna break down the ingredients that this guy uh, laid out. He laid out a nice recipe. The chef is in the kitchen here. So we're gonna start with an empty gray paint seal, or like, I guess just an empty uh, paint bucket. I don't know why it specifically has to be gray, but uh, up next, we're gonna go with some salad oil. Up next, we cannot forget the classic pasteurized blonde beer which undeniably has to be the thing that makes it smell the most rancid. Now, when you're throwing something like this on someone, you want to make sure your victim is nice and hydrated. That is, of course, the number one priority. We got to get a large Aww. container of water in there. Now, this one is kind of a luxury, depending on the time of year. You might have it, you might not. Make sure you're popping some leaves in there. Just find the dankest and most wet and moist leaves you can find. Now, I saved the best for last. Make sure you go. You can ask a neighbor. You can go to a local park. You can basically find this anywhere in a decent-sized city. Usually, you can pick this up for free if you don't mind getting your hands a little dirty but come on this is the key ingredient this is the chef's kiss this is the secret formula that mr krabs doesn't want anyone to know about that's right we're throwing in some actual dog shit now i'm not very familiar with belgian law or uk law but i'm pretty sure just adding something like feces of any animal changes it from just dumping something on someone to a whole new crime within itself now after you've mixed all this up together you're going to either take it to a train station you can take it to a public venue a public park your choice you're gonna find somebody that is literally minding their own business and just chilling and you're gonna dump it right on their head all jokes aside don't obviously do this i don't feel like i need to tell anybody that and the weird thing is this guy's actually gotten some views on some of his other videos for this i think this might be like a weird fetish thing i'm not sure but genuinely this is one of the dumbest things i've ever seen one of the dumbest pieces of content and i guess we're starting 2024 off right one weird tangent here is the weird thing is he's posting this for the views right it's very out there it's a quote-unquote prank so he's trying specifically to get more views by doing crazy stuff like like this right well this is literally like we talked about breaking the law and youtube has policy against posting things that are actively breaking the law so his channel is probably going to get fully terminated if it isn't already by the time i upload this so congrats i guess on giving yourself a criminal record if you didn't already have one just for a dead channel i don't know about you guys but my bucket's already mixed so uh can't let it go to waste